And new tonight, the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children's Cyber Tip Line received almost 32 million reports of apparent child sexual abuse material in 2022. Law enforcement in Wapalo County says their investigators have become more proficient at identifying these cases, but they still face some challenges taking them to court. KTVO's Maddie Lee reports. When Brittany Smith's Facebook profile goes live, Atumwa PD says it could take anywhere from a few days to just 10 seconds for people to start interacting with the fake miners' account. Um, the accounts that we that we maintain are consistently receiving messages. Investigator Stanton may spend weeks or months engaging in casual conversation with a potential predator before they attempt to exploit the minor sexually. OPD's Lieutenant Bell estimates this has led to about a dozen arrests in the past year. Even online gaming systems, we had an individual here in Ottumwa who uh, was randomly befriending people on the uh, platform of the gaming system and he was interacting with them while playing the games while well, he would befriend them. He would request uh, them take inappropriate pictures of themselves and send them to him and he was putting money on their uh, gaming system profiles in exchange. Portraying himself as a minor helped the individual entice his victims into sending child sex abuse material, or CSAM for short. According to the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children, the most common way CSAM gets traded is through a victim's parent or guardian, followed by online enticement like the case Lieutenant Bell described. The Wapolo County Attorney says this aspect is one of the biggest challenges when prosecuting child sex abuse cases. People like to think about sex abuse as done by someone that's a stranger. More often than not, it's almost always family or a family friend. And so we see a lot of families pressuring either their daughter to drop charges on the dad, to, on their brother, and frankly, that's the hardest block because we can't rip a child away from their parents to make sure they're a witness in a case so that's that's been the hardest part on social media lieutenant bell says predators are not shy about sending friend requests and recommends that minors do not accept unless it's someone they know in person in Atumwa, maddie lee ktvo news